Hello friends, welcome to TechNet Corporation and as described in the title, uh, today I'm going to tell you that how you can uh, print your name in the output screen in C++. So before the video starts, as told in the preview screen before the video that this video is applicable for those who are using the code blocks IDE for the C++ uh, coding. For, for instance, if you are using Turbo C++, then although it is applicable, you can use most of the codes uh, similar. There are certain changes which are vital, and if you use the correct uh, codes of that compiler, then it's okay. But if you use the code what I am using in Turbo C++, then it's going to show some fatal errors. So it is recommended that if you're using Turbo C++, then you can watch this video or you can wait for my another tutorials. And if you're using code blocks, because most of the majority of people nowadays use code blocks, then you can watch my video. So first of all, before the so to print your name, what you do uh, do as usual include and then you go to iOS stream. Okay. But it's not like printing an integer, because an integer, what it happens is that what you do is simply type int, then a variable, then go to C out, type a statement, then go to sin, and give a output, uh, take an input from user, and then print it. But basically the same process uh, executes over here, but over here we're going to use the string command. And for that, we need to use another library, which is the string library, and for that, what you're going to use is go to this hash, okay, include, include, S-T-R-I-N-G string and then pointy brackets closed and then we are going to type using name space STD as usual and it's almost and now it's all similar to uh, like what you do in integer we are going to type S-T-R-I-N-G string and then what we are going to do is first name because what we are going to create a program over here is that which will take your first name, your last name and display the full name so what you're going to do is first name, last name, and then semicolon. But the difference over here is that was, uh, you are not going to use a plus sign. You, we don't need a variable called full name because over here we're going to use just these two variables. Because in integer, if you want to take two sums then a of a and b, then you need another variable which is the sum. But over here, what you're going to do is that we are going to concatenation uh, of uh, strings. So basically we don't need that. So what you're going to do is type int and then main main and then two brackets open close and then pointy brackets open so basically a program gets executed over here what I'm going to do is type C out and then we're going to type enter enter your fir st first name enter your first name then colon and then we are don't, don't give a line break over here because that will look ugly then go to sin and uh, don't give a sin then user input take it uh, the first name f i r s t n a m e first name and then semicolon then go to c out c out and then go to enter your last name and then go to that colon give colon and without the line break again then sin lst enemy last name basically we type double t lst last name and this one then what we are going to do is just display a full name and for that what we are going to use is concatenation of strings not another variable so what you are going to do is your full name is then this one so you are going to go and give first enemy first name plus okay then we're going to give another bracket for space then this one then again and then last enemy last name and then give uh, the line break command and then and then read you uh, and return zero semicolon so that's it for the coding part it's just done everything you need then what you're going to do is go to compiler it's going to compile it Okay, my antivirus is going to pop up now, so wait for a second. It's going to always hampers my work, this antivirus. I'm going to okay, so enter your first name over here. Type your first name, for instance, my first name, if I write it as Lionel Messi with my god. Lionel, then last name Messi. Okay, Messi. And your full name is Lionel Messi. Lionel Messi. That's it. 
that's what the simple statement is I will also pro give you the commands and the codes in the description box also and please follow this tutorial series because this series name is C++ beginners tutorial over here I will not teach you about very beginner things like how to print integer or how to add two numbers I will tell you about the if statements the conditional statements and the iterations and loops and all those things and basically about some imp interesting things for instance the printing a string is not anywhere in the beginners tutorial because they teach you how to uh, print integers but you can find a bunch of videos on YouTube about that and if you click and I'm very lucky that you clicked on my video so please subscribe to my channel and help me because subscribing isn't a bad thing and for a small youtuber like me if you subscribe it helps me so please 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 subscribe to my channel and follow these playlists because I'm going to teach you about C++ tutorials thanks for watching and another thing what I want to tell you is that if you want to play close this console application so rather than going and clicking on this button just type click on F10 and it's closed F10 and the shortcut key to close the console or command prompt is by clicking F10 if you want some more shortcut videos like that on interesting shortcuts then you can check out the video which is currently appearing on the to top right corner of your screen and check that video out because that's also a fantastic video with shortcuts and if you want something more cool then just you can check out my channel thanks for watching and please like and share this video and don't forget to subscribe to my part because I really need subscribe